All right, let's jump in. Hey, you made it. Me and Ashu have been here a while. Ain't noticed anything unusual yet. Man, I hate ghost cases. Us waiting here is a bit unusual. That's true. Waiting in a group is fun, though. I saved you a seat. Did you hear that? I think I hear something. It's getting louder. Sir, if it's a ghost, how do we catch it? Uh, a ghost! Ah! Water, need water. Well, I'll be a rooster's rocket. It's a giggler. Haven't seen any of them near here since we cleared them out of Gecko Station. I can confirm it's not a giggler ghost, sir. He must have really liked rock climbing, but he's hurt. What should we do with him? Yeah, I agree. Not our style to turn away those in need, but he does look kind of familiar, don't you think? All right, unsure. Let's get this guy over to Dr. Fangs. We'll decide what to do with him once he's got the strength to speak up. Nice face. Bump your head. Yeah, probably. That usually happens when you fall off a cliff. Oh, sorry. Too soon? It's... a giggler. Can you help him? Not a vet. Look, he's got arms and legs and stuff, so I guess he's kind of human. No way. Right? <sighs> I will. That's all we're asking. Now listen, Burr and Fang, this fella here could be extremely dangerous. So if he starts waking up or fidgeting or anything, you better fly over to me on the double. Yeah, so he seems to be the uh, king of the gigglers, but it looks like he lost a lot of weight. <laughs> like a shit ton of weight. Like he got really small. Wait, his name's Larry? <laughs> well, while I'm at Fangs... So the other stuff we need is composite fiber rods. I guess probably the most sustainable way 
is to have a couple of these still frames being automatically produced and then I can produce like the other half. So that'll probably be the best way to do it. So once we get all the materials, I'll have it like automatically build like five of them and then I'll try and build the other five or so like by hand. So this is going to take some time. So go to bed and pass the time. Got that. Got that. See what's in the mill. City Hall, 28th season. Oh, yeah, seasonal stuff. Collect the water. Fiber stuff. Aluminium. <coughs> so I just need ten more of those. Actually, I'm going to split the workload. So that way we're not waiting 18 minutes. We're waiting nine minutes instead. Stack on a little bit more. So let's see. Actually, don't need four of them, but that's cool. Uh, let's see. Just ten more zinc titanium alloy and a bunch of other copper fiber rods which let's update the queue wanting to see what level I need to be in order to equip our new weapon. 50! <laughs> okay, so that's a level 50 weapon. That's gonna be fun. Revesto? if I can actually just start queuing it up. So let's add a queue. Still frames. I can build five. So let's just let it do it automatically. Oh shit, I'll just let it do it automatically then. has been updated. Let's see. 
All right, yeah, we're just work, working on the way stuff. Huh. Finish that up, hopefully by today. And I think the composite fiber rods are going to take the longest. Next to, of course, just smelting down all of the zinc titanium. I could do some inventory management. Okay, I think we're back at the beginning. Looks like I might need a few more, uh, a few more, uh, chest. Okay, so that's done. Actually, I'm gonna reduce the energy cost and everything as well. Excuse me. So we just need eight more of those. And a few more alloy. It's all about the waiting game. All about the waiting. Might as well just sleep and it'll all be finished by then <laughs> instead of waiting. It's like, you know what? I can probably just sleep. Let's just do that. Instead of wait waiting like a mook. Just uh speed it up. Use the game's in in game mechanics hey, to my I advantage. To come and say goodbye to you directly. I'm going back to Atara tomorrow. That's right, I got the message from ACI yesterday. I've been in Sandrock longer than any other assignment. It's getting harder and harder to accept the reality of having to leave. The friends I've made here, it's kind of taboo for an agent, but it's something really special. I'm going to go and say goodbye to everyone else. I didn't expect to make so many friends here. You can always come back to see us. Well, I don't know where I'll be next. It's out of my hands now, but I have a feeling we'll see each other again. Anyway, I really feel like you helped to make Sandrock a special place for me. I'm getting on the early train tomorrow, so I wanted to come and see you here. I know you're busy, and I don't want to inconvenience you to come and see me off. So stay safe, okay? So long, partner. So long. Logan. 
Ah, they've finally been released. Cool. Blue Moon Saloon, 19 Hundo, tomorrow. Okay. Alright, got the composite rods. There we go. Now let's build the rest of these still frames. There's five more. <coughs> so yeah, we can build six, but I think that would be pushing it. Okay, let's go to Heidi. She was just here. Hey, what did the tunnel say at the trial when it's accused of a lack of foundation? I've been framed. Hey, well, now that you've given me these steel frames, it will be framed. We're one step closer to making that a reality. If there's anything else we need from you, I'll let you know. But drilling should be pretty close to done in a few days. Maybe take a break till then. And once we're through, we can all meet up again to talk about what's next. Yay. See ya. And thanks as always for the top-notch work. Oh, got a new outfit? Bright Kitty Duster. Huh. for the kitty duster. Got that. Let's check out its overall stats. It needs to be a level 40. So it's level 45. <coughs> Whoa. It has better defense points than my base stuff. Gives me a lot more stamina, 25 more HP, max HP increased by 4.5, and if you have less than 30% health, take less damage up to 8%. Not bad. Damn. Okay, Bright Kitty Duster apparently is better than the action stuff. Keep that on hand until we're at least level, what, 40... Five. Well, until then, oh, I need to definitely clean this apparently. <coughs> I had to 
coughing fit. Blech. 300, wow. So we got 300. Let's do that for him then. Tower frame. All right, so what do I need to make for the tower frame? Bronze pipes. Make th three, so that means I need lime, schmelt down some more bronze. Um, excuse me. Uh, iron latches. Steel frames. No. Nope. Hmm. Oh boy. Since those are going to take some time, I think once the steel bars are done, I'll try and queue up the mag uh, some magnesium. Not magnesium, but whatever. Magnes. I probably do need cast iron rods, so I'm just gonna start smelting those down. Because the cast iron rods, I think, are for. Yep, that. I'll just kind of go to bed until then. has to be apparently perfect, so. All right, graceful for well. Oh yeah, let's do that right now. Oh, hey, what brings you here? You know, I actually didn't want you guys to see me off. I even told Logan the wrong time. But honestly, when I saw you coming, I was really happy. <sighs> Sometimes, I wonder if I'm really suitable for this job. I feel like I've changed. I'm not the person I used to be. My training was all about suppressing your emotions, embracing solitude, and putting the mission before anything else. I don't know. I feel kind of distant to all that now. A good thing? I don't know. Maybe for a citizen, but for an agent getting ready for her next assignment? Wait, I shouldn't unload all of this on you. Sorry. Thank you. So, uh, ever think about the future? How about joining me? All passengers for Atara, please board. The train will be leaving shortly. Ah, that's me. Uh, Miss Grace. Come on and hop aboard. You've got an exciting journey ahead of you. <laughs> yep, Sand Rock to Atara. Best track in the free cities. Thank you, Jensen. One last word and I'll get aboard. I want to give you this. It's a little parting gift. Grace's photo. To remember me by. It's a picture of me during my old training days. The puppy next to me is my old partner, Cookie. He was a real sweet dog. See ya, Grace. Most likely we'll see you again somehow.
Cool. Bittersweet goodbyes. Now who's gonna burn the kitchen down? Okay, got plenty of cast iron rods. That stuff. Collect my water. Let's make some water. Deposit that into the water bank. See. Stuff. <clears throat> See if we can make just two more bronze pipes. And I think I need to make a bunch of copper screws as after that. And then So let's start smelting those down. Three for each one. Oh, actually, how much did it want? Twelve, so we'll do... Seven here. Oh, well, yeah. And we'll do seven here. <laughs> Technically, six to six, but... We might need an extra steel bar or something like that too that will be finished in 11 minutes so yeah Vincep's making 14 not 12 it's like shush you oh yeah so Bunch of other things going on in town, so I guess while I'm waiting, see what's going on. So I probably need to activate these in some form or fashion so I can, uh, wait, there's, oh, I guess there's one at the train station. Gans out. Oh, he's being Hello there. transported. We're Alliance Guards, here on behalf of the Commerce Guild. We're just about to take Yan here over to the Atarn Correctional Facility. His case sparked interest in the criminal psychology department. I'm a genius! A criminal mastermind! E equals MC crime! I think it was something more along the lines of, they wanted the chance to study a textbook narcissistic sociopath. You want to write a book about me? Fine! Sure! Long as I get royalties and my face on the cover. Yeah! Old Yan's making a comeback! Right. Well, before we go, I wanted to just ask you a few questions. Being in the same guild as Yan here for so long, well, you're kind of a key witness in some of his crimes. We don't need you to appear in court. Just a simple, spoken testimony will be enough. I suppose, if someone had something good to say about Yan, 